Hello, boys and girls. Today, the story I have chosen to read is titled, Charlie the Ranch Dog, Stuck in the Mud. This story is based on the Charlie the Ranch Dog books, written by Ree Drummond. She's also known as the Pioneer Woman. She wrote the story with Diane de Grote. Charlie the Ranch Dog, Stuck in the Mud. This is the title page, and it says the title again. Charlie the Ranch Dog, Stuck in the Mud. Oh my goodness, look at the expression on Charlie's face. Do you see the mud on his nose? Wake up! Wake up! I race around the ranch house. Get out of bed. It's time to go out to the pasture. Hang on. I better eat just a bit more breakfast. Moving cattle is a big job. I'll need my strength. I run down the porch steps, and Mama helps me into the back of the truck. We're on our way! Arr! The air is crisp. The sky is blue. My tongue goes flappy, flap, flap in the wind. I smell cows far away across the green grass. Did you know not every dog can be a cattle dog? In the middle of the cattle herd, some dogs get a little crazy. They chase, they bark, they run around in circles. Not me. No way. I stay calm, cool, and collected. Mama and the other cowgirls and cowboys, they ride behind the herd. I'm on high alert in case they need my backup. I spot a small calf. Her name is Abigail. Oh, look out! She starts to stray. That means she starts to leave the herd. That's a problem. Speed up just enough to put a little pressure on Abigail. See? She heads right back to the herd. Huh? Hey! Get back here. Okay, that's it. It's chase time. I weave and bob here and there, under one heel, then the other. I am the greatest cattle dog this ranch has ever seen. Oh. Abigail runs faster and faster. I'll catch her. I'm fast. I'm clever. I am focused. And I'm stuck. The mud is thick and gooey. Lift! I tell my legs. They weigh a hundred pounds. They won't budge. Don't worry, Abigail. I'll, I'll get us out of this mess. The cattle dog never panics. This is no big deal. We'll be just fine. My long floppy ears, they feel sticky. Mud, mud is everywhere. I shake my head to get it off. Hi, ouch! My eyes, it stings! I 
smell Abigail nearby. I tried to lean a little closer. Poof! I fell. I fell face first. All I smell is a nose full of mud. scratches behind my ears. I hear mama's voice. She cleans my eyes. I see mama and Abigail. She's free. My how it must have done the trick even when I can't move, can't see, and can't even smell. I never lose my cool. There's no cattle dog like me. Oh, wonderful, warm, dry ranch house. Mama hops out of the truck. Oh, no, not the hose. I hate baths. But I hate mud more. Mama, Mama wraps me in a fluffy towel. I roll on my back. I'll take a belly rub, please. And an extra strip of juicy bacon just for saving the day. <laughs> the end.